Hi, I'm Kartha Gewert, and this is Nitro Spectre. Today we are trying a hard mode. It's really loud. Today we're trying to relax. Okay. We are doing a hard mode Rangoli. I was looking around at Rangolis because I really like to I like to watch videos of these ones, and I saw one in particular that was so beautiful, so oddly satisfying that I'd be so happy if I could make it. So. Let's go. I can't believe he was chewing through the whole intro. <laughs> First thing we're going to do is we're going to take this ring right here and we're going to put little white dots around it. Now usually I have a white background but I want the white sand to really do its thing so this time we have a black background and this is on its own little surface so I can keep the Rangoli active for the next little while. I did that last time but it was just like on my table. This I can move it. It's getting a little antsy. Nope. No! <laughs> okay. Maybe you just can't be part of the experiment, oh, Nitro. Nitro, you, you might have to get out of here. You poor thing. Oh. No, you put that down right now. Oh. Okay, let's move Nitro. We go again with our sand art. I kind of had a feeling that Nitro was going to ruin it, but I wanted to let him, you know? I just wanted to, I wanted to let him get his mark in. Do you ever see someone doing something and you know they're gonna screw it up and just let them? <laughs> I do that sometimes. Maybe that's what the audience is doing right now. Yeah, they're just letting me make my mistakes. No problem. It's one of the only arts I've ever seen where you can use so many different colors and it can still look really beautiful. Cause I'm the kind of person, I'm a more is more person with color. I'm obsessed with color. But a lot of the times when I choose all these different colors, people are like, that's way too much, Kartha. That's way too much. I like this cause more is more. More is better and it looks delicious. Cause it looks like salt. It looks like sugar. Almost there. Yeah, it's getting there. It's funny because this is the easy part. <laughs> and it's making me nervous. So that looks really good. I'm just gonna like clean it up a little bit with some... Body won't I'm gonna clean it up with a little plastic knife. It's probably gonna have stuff around it, so I'm not gonna like go too hard on cleaning it up. I just wanna clean it up a little bit. Man, would it be easier if I just use my fingers? Probably. Yep. It's way easier. In the last video, when I got the fly swatter out, that was easy. This time I need something small like a thumb. Now I'm gonna take this little ring off. I'm scared. Actually, no, I'm not. Not yet. Not yet. Or should I? Yeah, I'm gonna take it off. Okay. <gasps> Stencil. No! Hmm? Hmm? Going? Yeah. Oh, this is my purple. We're gonna go on the inside now with really big circles. Big bold, beautiful circles. Mmm, that's nice. Orange! I love the black background. I'm very, I'm very happy with it because the white just shows up so gorgeous. I want, I want stiff peaks on the top here. Stiff peaks now, quick peaks meow. There we go, nice, hey? Mm -hmm. I might add more to them later, I just want to play it by ear and not mess it up. My sand art. My Rangoli. It's just a little pixie wixy dust, huh? Now there, there's some like bleeding um, going on like in the middle of the ring, but I don't think that's really gonna matter in a moment. I think I need a bit more pink, eh? Make it match a little bit more. This is a beautiful color combination. Next, I want blue. This is the type of blue that'll keep you up at night. Gorgeous. Oh no. I'm gonna change the lid on the screen. These are pretty cheap containers, pretty cheap plastic Amazon containers. And uh, some of the lids are just not good. Mostly but because the dog chewed them up. No, mostly because they're not good. I mean, that one didn't come like that. Oh yeah, I mean, you know, I can't win them all. I wanted to put more colors in here, but I don't have enough colors to do it. So I'm just gonna do a mirror image of these colors and hopefully I can use more bright colors on the other, on the, you know, on the other side. She's nervous. Yeah, 
this is the easiest part. I shouldn't be stressing about this. You guys are gonna die when you see how complicated this gets, but it is so beautiful, like the end product. <gasps> wow. <laughs> this is gonna be an art piece you can really set your watch to. People probably only set their watches to the internet nowadays, not to like good meals or great shows. I wonder what was the last generation that like manually set a watch and and manually like wound watches backwards for, I mean, I guess that'd be the same group, but the last group, like what kind of people are like dying out? People who manually set alarms? Pocket watch. Pocket watch people. Ooh. They're probably gone. Yeah, they're probably, they died. <laughs> Just like the monocle, those people are gone. Do we miss them though? Probably not. Miss the style. You, you don't know. miss the guys? No. They're probably rude. Probably look down on a lot of people. Yeah, you think they're stuck up? Yeah. They probably wouldn't want me like sitting anywhere near them. Where do people set their watches accurately before the internet? I don't know! Oh my goodness, they probably have to like look at the sun, like the sundial in the middle of the town and all go set their watches. <laughs> now that's a sundial you could set your watch to. <laughs> Look how beautiful this is. It looks yummy, doesn't it? It looks yummy, yummy, yummy. I've got love in my tummy. It looks like it has that yummy, yum, yummy, yum. What? That Justin Bieber? Yeah. I don't think he says that. It's got that yummy, yum, that yummy, yum. No? Uh, sure. What are we doing now? Oh, okay, so now we're taking a spoon. And then we're gonna drag each of these to the middle. I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you. Anyway, see ya. Oh. That looks pretty good. You think? Yeah. Does that look good? Mm-hmm. Does that look good? I think so. Dang it. I can see you in this one. Really? That's pretty good. Whoops. Oh my goodness, weird. Super weird. Okay, I'm gonna redo the pink, I think. Cause that is super weird. And I just don't know if I can live with that. I like how it kind of has like a flower petal vibe where like some are on top of the others, but the pink is just not. Huh? Some, some touch ups. Yeah. Hoy, that's wild. This is wild. Some things just seem easy, but um. <laughs> it'll get clean. Uh, it'll get cleaner, okay? For now, we're gonna hide our shame, cover our mistakes. Sometimes it's what a girl's gotta do. Just letting gravity make the circle, huh? I guess so. Although it's not very even, so it's kind of hard to make the circle, you know? But, alas, sometimes you can't always get what you want. This is funny because I thought this was gonna be the easy part, but guess what? It's not. <laughs> big trouble. I'm in big trouble. Big, big trouble. Why? Because I thought that was the easy part, and it ain't. I'm gonna go in at the end and, you know, try my best to fix things. But um, that's a little rough, it's a, it's a little rough. Now we put little piles of red in heel. And it's kind of interesting what we do with this red. By the way, the video credit is linked in the description because I did not come up with this. I mean, it doesn't look like I did. Okay, so I'm putting my finger in and I'm just kind of like pushing this out to the outside of the circle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get it. Oh, it's so easy. Maybe this is the easy part. Maybe, but I don't like how the very center is botched, so we gotta work on that later. Now we're going in with some orange. We're trying to make a rainbow in these little circles. Oh, how cute. Working. Yeah. This is so satisfying for me. I've just never had this much control. With the middle, I didn't have any control. With this, I have so much control. Look at this. You just bam, and it's gorgeous. It's like a beautiful gradient, a beautiful rainbow. Not an orange there, but orange kind of always gets lost. Why is green right next to yellow in the rainbow? It doesn't seem like they're that close to each other, does it? That's what you get when you start adding more like blues and stuff to yellow. Put that vial, take a little spoon. Pink, pink, bonk, donk. And then I'm putting dark purps in the center here. 
Mm -hmm. It's like a little eyeball, eh? It's watching over you. It's making sure you do a good job. Cool, huh? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, not bad, huh? So we have our little rainbow circles and they're very, very cute and pretty. Um, the center is still making me mad and I hope I can figure out how to fix it. But we're gonna just finish, we're gonna try our best to finish this border, which is going to be more of these like little white circles. It's gonna take you a while. Yes, that is for sure. Oh, we're almost there. We kind of had to tag team it a little bit. And by almost there, I mean almost done these little leaves. These little leaves. And it, like, despite how boshed the middle is, it looks pretty cute. I would say. Okay, now some outer details. I feel like what went wrong with the middle piece is that the first time I ever did this, I did it with a toothpick. Doing it with the spoon was so detrimental to everything I believe in. These are little bits. Do you like little bits? Love little bits. Yeah, these are just some little bits. Little bits. Eek! Eek! Yeah! There's supposed to be an additional rainbow element on the outside of this, but the box isn't big enough, I don't have enough space. So I'm trying to think of how to improve the middle because everything else I feel turned out so nice and the middle is just not, it's just not symmetrical. And it's really bothering me. It's not oddly satisfying to me. I was thinking about like doing a swirl into it just to like kind of ruin the design, like doing a swirl, but then it's gonna lose that like pretty texture. I don't know. The best thing would have just been to redo it at the beginning, but we built around this baby. We built around our faulty foundation because sometimes that's what it is. Like sometimes on the outside, you're looking cute and polished. And sometimes on the inside, you're, there's a little turbulence. There's a little asymmetry, but it is a something. If you go from like the side, it's like not too bad. Yeah, it's just the fact, it's just it from the front that really bothers me. Also another issue that I've been having is that when I'm filming, I like, I like to be able to see the camera. I don't want you guys to see the top of my head the whole time. So I, like if I was actually like going full try hard, I'd be like looking over it like this and it'd be a different story. I want to put the rainbow details on the outside, but we can't, they can't fit. Yeah, we're pretty close to the edge there. Yeah. I'm going to put an inner ring of circles and then I'm going to press those circles. The outsides are like, I mean, they're kind of bad, but the worst part is the inside. Yeah. But I have to use colors I never used before. Blue, purple. Or I could use the same colors. I should use the same colors. The problem with this is they're not gonna be perfectly circular, but there's nothing a girl can do. I'm putting my concentration face on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you, you silly sand art, you. The sand art is such a tease. It looks so easy. And then it's just not. I need enough room here for purple. Or I need to just let purple go. Looks to me like I'm letting purple go. <laughs> it's not bad. Okay, so now I'm gonna press in. so bad at first, but like I can live with this now. It's not perfect, but I can live with it. And I like it in my home. Well guys, this is the Rangoli. Take a good look, take a good look. I'm leaving soon, take a good look. Memorize it. This is the Sandor. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, ah. Well guys, that's the sand art. I mean, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you had fun. I hope it was relaxing. I hope it was all these satisfying. I'm so sorry about the middle at first, but hey, it's looking pretty okay now. Let me know what you think in the comments and uh, feel free to feel free to talk to me about this type of art because I appreciate, I appreciate the dialogue.
I actually do. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you on the next one. Bye.